two, we're going to look at the vessels and organs of the abdomen and leg. Um, last week, we went ahead, cut through the thoracic cavity, became familiar with all those structures. This week, you want to start off right about here at the diaphragm, make a cut straight down to, well, the legs. You can see I also cut down along the diaphragm so you can open things up similar to this. As you're working down, you want to be careful not to catch some of these, you know, fine structures like, you know, the spermatic, um, parts of the spermatic cord, the uh, spermatic artery, things like that. All right. I like to clean things so that you can look at everything on the left side. And so what we're looking at here, there's our diaphragm. Um, I'm lifting the stomach, which is right here. You can see some of the liver there and the spleen. We'll get to those in a moment. But looking at the vessels, pull things up. First vessel you can see, that's your celiac artery. Then you have your superior mesenteric. Coming off of there is the adrenal lumbar artery. That's the adrenal gland. Right there is the adrenal lumbar vein. Oftentimes that vein is coming directly off the inferior vena cava. This time a little different coming off of that renal. So that brings us to the renal vein and the renal artery. Running over here to the kidney. You can see this little nub right here. It didn't perfuse real well, but that's actually, in this case, since it's a male cat, that's the spermatic vein, which runs right down here and would run down with the ureter. Okay, as far as the artery goes, kind of work our way down the abdominal aorta. Right here, you can see that is the spermatic artery. It comes over, attaches to that ureter, and runs down into the spermatic cord. On the other side, there's the right spermatic artery, still intact a little better. Okay, I cut the ureter so we could see some of these other structures. Next major branch we're looking for. So we have our spermatic artery right here, because we're lifting up the ureter. Here's the inferior mesenteric, and then we're looking at both the artery and the vein. These are the iliolumbars. All right. From the iliolumbar, you can see how things start to branch off to the legs. With the artery, this is the external iliac artery, and it's called external iliac until it gets to this little branch right here. That's the deep femoral. From the deep femoral, that pipe continues on, got cut as the femoral, until it you now comes to this little branch right here, or actually right here, which is the proximal caudofemoral. That's it. Okay, looking for the internal. So that's external iliac. You can see this little branch. There's the internal iliac. And then deeper yet, right here, there's the caudal artery and vein. Now, as far as the veins go, again, we have our iliolumbars and we have a common iliac. It's common until well, you get to the internal iliac. And you can see the internal iliac on the other side too, so common, and then there's the internal iliac. And after that internal iliac, this pipe is now called the external iliac. Then it's deep femoral, femoral, which I just broke, and then proximal caudofemoral, and then saphenous. All right, as far as the organs go, some structures you need to know. This is a male cat. We're looking right here, there's the spermatic, and this is the vas deferens. Kind of pull things around this way. This is the urinary bladder, and here we can see that vas deferens again on the other side. This conduit here that's carrying the vessels and the vas deferens down to the testis is the spermatic cord. You need to be able to identify that. And then the testis itself, I've removed one of the membranes, that's the tunica vaginalis. And then under that, you have the testis itself, and then this structure right here, that's the epididymis. Okay, working our way back up, we have our kidney and our adrenal gland in the kidney. You can open that up, and you can see right in the middle, that's the renal pelvis. This is the medulla, and that's the cortex. These are two regions. If I ask for a structure, this structure is one big pyramid. In cats, there's like a pyramid, whereas in humans, there's multiple. Okay, kind of reorient some of the organs. 
Again, we have diaphragm. This is the stomach, which I will not open, but if it is open, you could see gastric rugae. We have the spleen. The greater omentum is all of this fatty looking stuff. And then you have the liver. There's the gallbladder on the liver. And if I lift the liver, again, you're seeing the stomach a little more and all this little fat running off of the lesser curvature of the stomach, that is the lesser omentum. So it's stomach, liver, lesser omentum, greater omentum. Work your way on around that stomach. And you see his little dimple right here, it kind of pushes in. That's the pyloric sphincter. That's where the stomach ends and the small intestine, in this case the duodenum, begins. Now, working our way on down around the duodenum, pyloric sphincter, duodenum, and right in that curvature of the duodenum, is the pancreas. So that's all pancreatic tissue right there. Um, lifting further, so there's the gallbladder, there's the duodenum, that's the hepatic portal vein, and you can also see the hepatic vein between the liver and the diaphragm. So right there's the hepatic, it plugs right into the inferior vena cava. Okay, some of the other structures kind of lift the greater omentum out of the way. And again, you're looking at the spleen, vast majority of the small intestine. Um, really can't identify the jejunum via a gross anatomically, but we can find the ileum where it plugs into the large intestine, which we're looking at right here. So this is the colon. Right there is the ileum plugging in. On the inferior side, there's the ileum. Now, on the large intestine, right below the ileum is this little pouch, and it's called the cecum. And then we have, we kind of lift it, have the whole colon, you have the ascending, transverse, descending, aka sigmoid. So just kind of draw imaginary lines. And that's pretty much it.